Hello everyone. Today, this afternoon, I want to do well I just happened to have by coincidence this Canadian IMP laying around. It's a uh, menu number 18 from 2015 and it's beef. Beef well, believe it or not, I watched a YouTube video on how to say this just five minutes ago. Beef borganine. Borganine beef it's beef. So anyway, y'all can look at this and pronounce it a lot better than me. Let's get this out of the tray and see what we have. All right. So we have our beef borganine. So we're going to open this up. I don't have no fancy uh, smitty bow and arrow or all right or explosives but I just use my fingers all right we have some sliced pears and we have some soldier fuel energy bar and we have a piece of cornbread I never had a piece of Canadian cornbread. Uh, well, a product of the USA. I never had any cornbread from the USA to Canada and back to here. And we have mashed potatoes. That sounds pretty good. A peach sports drink. And then we have our our beef borgen borgenine, whatever that might be. We have the beverage bag. Our pretty heavy duty napkin. A white spork. Then we have sugar, some whitener for tea or coffee, strawberry jam, some Frank's Red Hot. I give it to Samuel. He likes hot sauce now. He watched Eeyore. Some espresso, espresso, some gross coffee, some matches. Moist towel it and two pieces of gum. All right, we're gonna get this in a tray, not in a tray. We're gonna heat this up from Baxter's. Our beef, our beef. All right, let's get our mashed potatoes. Well, yeah, let me start rip off the whole top of this. Add water to the to the line right there. Put a little crease. Yeah, that works out pretty good. I can do this without burning myself. Whew. Shit! Oh shoot! It's hot. Get my spoon up here and reach down in here and stir this. It smells kind of like milk. Let's make our, let me put our whitener, put that in there for our espresso, which I couldn't see a while ago. We're going to use our foreignmre.com mug for that. I 
and we're going to put in the sugar and it's hot in here because you can't turn the air conditioner on you won't be able to hear me talk and somewhere we're going to go ahead and open this cornbread up so I can get it out of the way I think I might have had cornbread the other day maybe I did have I can't remember I'd have to look Hmm. Maybe it was Smitty saying corn cake instead of cornbread. It says, well, I don't really say how much to mix it with. Smells good and good and strong. And we got our Ford MRE dot com spork. Peanut butter soldier fuel bar. We'll open that up. And since I haven't had anything to eat today since about 11:30, and it's about seven, I'm gonna take a bite. Similar to a first strike bar. It's a little bit easier to chew. our peach sports drink 250 milliliters of water we're going to use our non safe to use Ozark Mountain Cup from Walmart it came with warning labels let's see this bottle it's 500, so we're going to put both of the packages in there. Well, believe it or not, I lost my other thing of peach. That just chaps my head. Maybe I'll find it here in a minute and add it to it. But use this Canadian IMP spoon. Says peach, looks like orange. Might taste like a pear. Nope, tastes like peach. Pretty good. This is extremely hot. Get out my dentist knife. You wore knife is in the house, dentist knife is outside. It smells like I just poured it right on top of cornbread crumb. See it. I couldn't really tell you what that smells like. I really wouldn't want to tell you what it smells like. So, get out my more reasonable size spork. This is a long reach spork. About a taste. I guess that's a, a well, looks like a mushroom. 
Maybe that's what a born or a is a mushroom. Hmm. That's what it is, beef and mushrooms. Well, I guess when I looked up the how to pronounce it, I should have looked up what it was. That's pretty delicious. Alright, get my pears out here. Baxter pears. I really had peaches, but pears are pretty good. Looking a little bit different color. We won't just gobble up a big old big old bite, we'll take a little smaller bite. Oh yeah, I'm pretty good. Tastes like a pear. Well that leaves us with all the mashed potatoes. I got these mashed potatoes. These they actually look pretty good for mashed potatoes just out of an old bag you carry around with you. Mm. I'm just going to put them right down there in that. These are still hot enough to make you cuss. They give you actually quite a bit. And you still got something right there that's not mixed up. We just mix it up with the gravy this. Oh yeah, wonderful. I still got Maryland's cakes on my mind, so y'all have to excuse me. That was a nice trip to St. Louis. See Mike and Marilyn. Go to her award-winning bakery and everything. Wonderful time. Taste his coffee, espresso. That's pretty strong. I like that. You can actually taste it. I don't know what the trouble is. I don't have Alexis out here to help me. I'm going to take this right here. I'm going to take half of this. Give us a taste. Yep, more like a corn cake. We're going to mix it up with some, some strawberry on it. I hear the cows out there. And I guess that other thing of peach. Wherever it's at, it's with the peanut butter. Oh, heck, fire. Well, this came with peanut butter and another thing of peach drink. But my 60 square feet of camping trailer right here must have fell in a crack somewhere. Well, I'll find that peanut butter one of these days. But we got the MRE Nation Extreme Snack Pack. And I bet it has some peanut butter in it. off the bat peanut butter so I think this peanut butter from Canada anyway is made in Stone Mountain Georgia and this is made in Savannah Georgia so the Stone Mountain Georgia so we're going to put some peanut butter with this strawberry jam from Canada and this thing here is a huge amount of peanut butter Get my long handle spoon right here. Stir that up a little bit. Mm. 
and then take a bite. Mm. That's actually pretty good. I could eat this if I go out to eat or some peanut butter jelly and a piece of cornbread. Now back to these mashed potatoes and beef and mushrooms. Well, this is pretty good. These mashed potatoes are real good. And this peach sports drink is delicious. Well, everybody, that does it for 2015 beef and mushrooms. And uh, so, thanks for watching, and we'll be back at you some other time with probably not an MRE video. I got something else to do. I want to do a video on. Well, it's going to come out first, and this one be next. You'll see the other one first. It's just going to be a four or five minute video on a, on a ride on a lawnmower well thanks everyone and y'all have a good day bye